Are you ready to ride? What do you think this does? Wow! This is incredible! Check it out! <laughs> this is insane! Chocobo racing's nothing like that. Well, you would know. Right now, I want to be with you. And I'm trying so hard to find you. But I'm right here. Yeah, you are. But... Hey. Did Tifa talk to you? About, um... Hey, um, Aerith? I talked to Cloud. He said he remembers Zach. <gasps> How they were friends five years ago. What? I don't think so. At least, not about anything important. Oh.
Thanks for tonight. You're welcome. But I didn't do anything. <laughs> well, market warriors, you and me. We'll show them tomorrow. Yeah. Sounds of the gold saucer. Are you ready to Watch rock? the adventure unfold before your very eyes. You ready for this? A gondola's here. Well, after you. You first. Uh, Cloud? Think we can steer with this? Worth a try. <laughs> Here goes! Safe. <laughs> hey, over there, see that? <sighs> Being a jockey looks so fun. That's definitely not what the races are like. I guess I'll just have to see for myself. They were friends five years ago. What? Not yet. Right. Touchy subject, huh? She must still have feelings for Zack. I think it's a little more complicated than that. Hey, it's kind of weird us being here like this, isn't it? Is it? I mean, I guess it is. Kinda. Ever since we left Midgar on this crazy journey, ever since we were kids even, I can't remember a time like this. A time when we were this close. Or am I getting ahead of myself again? Again? Yeah. Again. One bit.
We should probably head back to our rooms. Yeah, probably. Are you ready to ride? <laughs> Practice makes perfect. Practice for what? Uh, for when the real thing comes around. <laughs> hey, aren't you forgetting someone? She used to have a pretty big crush on you. That's so. Well, not at first. Apparently, even as a kid, you had that weird loner vibe. But then one day, bam! She caught the love bug! Are you into her? Don't remember. Really? Though, I guess that makes sense. Tifa said she was so busy after the move to Midgard that she forgot all about you, too. Don't know what it is about you guys, but I get it. I had a thing for a soldier once. At least I think he was a soldier. I wanted to prove myself, so I hit him with my best moves. <laughs> Was like I was firing energy blasts. After a few salvos, he shouted, You got me! And at the time, I totally bought it. Of course, he was just playing along for a dumb kid. And once I realized that, I was pissed. I couldn't stop thinking about him. I swore to myself that one day I'd blast that jerk for real. Did some hardcore training so I could give him a beatdown. But eventually, it dawned on me. He was just being nice. Like, he was a really nice guy. And the more I thought about it, the more I realized... Wow. I liked him. You know? Maybe it's because of those feelings that I still can't fire energy blasts. I can help. Uh, with the energy blasts? Or my feelings? The former. Feelings ain't my thing. <sighs> I think we both kinda suck in that department. I mean, 
mean, that that is the sort of thing you're supposed to do in these situations. It was just practice. So, so don't go thinking it means anything, okay? Oh, say something! You're so annoying! <laughs> hey, if I ever see that guy again, what should I do? That's up to you. But if it were me, I'd let him have it. <laughs> Tonight, and you're a dead man. <laughs> Are you ready to ride? Before your very eyes, each moment. Are we really doing this? Could use some peace and quiet, couldn't you? Come on. What's this? It? Just messing with you. About your age, I decided I'd had enough of the mines. Wasn't much interested in any kind of work. I was young and wanted to enjoy my youth. And then I met a sweet girl named Myrna. Knew right away she was the one. But Myrna, she wasn't buying what I was selling. Told me she was in the market for a man, not a selfish little boy. If I was gonna win her heart, I had some growing up to do. Otherwise, she'd never give me the time of day. Funny enough, our first date was at a theme park. Nowhere near as big as this place, of course. Just a traveling fair with a handful of rides. We ended up riding these wooden chocobos round and round, laughing our asses off. First time. Don't worry. I'm used to it. <sighs> yeah, well, the lesson here is once you find your soulmate, you never let him go. So, who is it? Hmm? Who's what? You know damn well what I'm talking about. Why do you always have to overthink things? 
That ain't no way to live. You gotta just go for it sometimes. You mean like you do, all the time? Hmm. Touché. <laughs> you could say that we balance each other out. Yeah. <laughs> I mean it, though. If you do have feelings for someone, tell them straight out. Don't wait till it's too late. Right. Thanks for coming out tonight. I appreciate it. Tomorrow, we're gonna go to town on those suckers. Yeah. Are you ready to ride? Watch the adventure unfold before your very eyes. You're gonna drool on the seat. <laughs> Close call. doesn't leave the ride, okay? It might sound crazy, but back in Midgar, Aerith and I could both see the future. Well, that would explain a lot. I'm guessing you can't anymore, though? Nope. Not even a bit. Whatever we had, I think the Whispers took it from us when we left. Huh. It seems Arbiters of Fate can do whatever they want. So you told us. Oh, did I? Huh. I wonder if this means we'll eventually forget they even exist. We'd be better off if we did, frankly. There's no point in wasting our time worrying about fate if we can't change it. You're right. Still, there is one thing I need you to remember. You have to keep Aerith safe. Hmm. I mean it, Cloud. I don't remember what's supposed to happen, but I do know she's in danger. Shake. What? Shake on it. <laughs> they are soft. Huh? Nothing. Forget it. I'm 
Glad that we could speak in private, Cloud. Yeah. You're good company. Thanks. Watch the adventure unfold before your very own. Don't leave the flying to me. Eh, doesn't it work like that? We just sit here and spin? Ugh. Could have at least thrown in a joystick. That seems joysticky. Oh? <laughs> Some dumb kid's toy. Come on. At least we can enjoy the scenery. Just look. You've got a space battle unfolding right before your very eyes. Tell me that doesn't send a chill down your spine. Oh no! Evasive action! Hard to port! Oh, made it by the skin of our teeth. sometimes ask me to predict who will win a race. Ah, come off it, I tell them. If I could do that, I wouldn't they still be working here now, would I? Entertainment in spades, and all I get is crickets. Can we go any faster? This is torture. And how do you think I feel? Kate, zip it. Why are you taking his side? I'm the one trying to make this fun. <sighs> open the doors! Let me open this thing! Well, I'll be in the stands rooting for you tomorrow. Knock him dead. Huh. 